A celebration of life held today for slain Fort Valley State University student Anitra Gunn. Family and friends gathered at Greater Peace Baptist Church in Opelika, Alabama to remember the life of the 22 year old. Fort Valley Mayor Barbara Williams presented a proclamation to Gunn's family formally expressing her condolences on behalf of the city. Gunn was a senior agriculture student. She graduated from Westlake High School right here in Atlanta. Gunn went missing on Valentine's Day and after an intense search, authorities found her body in the woods on February 18th. Gunn's boyfriend, Demarcus Little, is accused of strangling her to death. He is charged with malice murder and he remains in jail. Police have now also believed one of Little's friends helped him cover up her death. He's still in jail tonight. A judge held off on setting bond for Javon Abram during his first appearance in Peach County Friday morning. The district attorney argued if Abram is let out of jail, it could compromise the investigation. Officers there haven't recovered all of the evidence as of yet. Warrants say Abram picked up Little after he dumped Gunn's car in a neighbor's yard on Valentine's Day.